Hello everybody, this is Christina with Tatterrose Studios and um, I tried making a video show, um, showing how I put together a Smashbook page and um, had some problems with my glue stick so I had to stop the video. So um, I'm still doing um, this video showing you how I put together my Smashbook only I've already started a little bit. Um, so. I'll just show you the tiny bit that I've already started. Um, this is for, um, since I'm doing a daily smash book, um, this is actually for Sunday the 22nd. I know it's not Sunday yet, but um, I know that my favorite show is ending and it is gonna be The Bachelorette, The Final Rose on Sunday. So I already have the pictures and everything and I'm just so excited I have to get this page done. So, um, what I've done so far is I've printed out some black and white um, palm trees and I um, glitter misted them with some pearlescence, perfect pearls. And um, so I did that. I added some bling up here and then underneath I have hidden um, a little um, chart of all the guys from the bachelorette or yeah from the bachelorette and except the and they're all crossed out except for the last two which is Jeff and Ari so I just have that hidden because I like to see that but um, for everybody else it's just hidden you don't see it um, so I got my other glue stick hot and ready so now I'm gonna start adding um, some flowers so let's get this started I'm just gonna some hot glue on here and glue it down and then in the center I'm using this cute bling and um, I think I got these at Hobby Lobby and they're just gorgeous and I have the diamond ones and I have the ones that look like um, it's got like a zebra print on it really cute okay so let's see there's one and I don't have it underneath the uh, above the picture but it's still I can still open it if I want to but like I said it's hidden just for me so I'll put another one here in here and grab another one of these and place it right on top of here okay so I have two flowers there and I'm kind of going for like the tropical theme because I I forget what where they're going to be for the final rose but I just wanted to look kind of glamorous and tropical since a lot of their dates are tropical. Um, let's see. Do I want to add some more? I have some of this too. I don't know if I want to add some underneath. Let me cut some out. It doesn't have to be perfect. Um, might put some underneath here. Let's see. Let me lift these up and put this back. I just gotta see what this looks like before I start gluing things down. Um, I don't know. What do you think? I really don't know. I mean, I like the fringe look on this, but I just need to start peeling some of this off to make it look kind of the same. 
All right. Now that I fringed it a little, it might look a little better. So I guess I will go ahead and glue some of this down. And hopefully it won't dry before I get it down. that dry for a second. Okay, I just don't want to stick to my photos. Let's put this back like that. And let's see. I don't know if I want a big flower under here. Nah. That won't look good. Okay, so let me add, I have these two little Michaels um, birds that I, I cut off the little bling on the eyeballs because they were all facing the same way and I wanted to have um, one facing this way and one facing this way. So I think I'm going to put them down here. So let's just put some glue on them. There's one birdie. Make sure I'm gluing the right sides. Okay. And there's the second birdie. Ah! These strings from the hot glue is pulling all my stuff down. Okay. And now for the eyes, since I did want to make them a little different, um, I'm going to take one of these blue gems and I'm going to actually use the hot glue. So I'll do the blue one over here. Tweezers out really quick. Okay, get that web out of there. And for the other one, I'm going to use a different color. And this is a little pearl. So I got the pink pearl for her and the blue eyes for the boy. Um, I also have this love ticket. Um, not sure where I want to put that yet. Uh, let's see. Let's do. You know, I think I still have something on the printer that I printed out. I do. I have this really cute um, stamp that says lovey dovey on it. And then um, I had this right here where it says bachelorette, but um, I am not sure if I'm going to use it or not. I might use it and then put glossy accents over it. Um, so. Uh, I don't know yet. Hmm. So let me just let's do start this page. Um, I'm gonna do. I have this palm tree, and then I have my two guys, Jeff and Ari. Um, I also have these cute little greeting farm cutouts. Here's a little boy and here's the little girl. 
They're from the Lovey Dovey um, Greeting Farm set. They come together. Um, so I have these two that I want to put on here. And I also added, um, I also printed out a little tiny little girl. And she is going to be Ricky, Emily's daughter. So um, I'm going to put this up as high as I possibly can. So let's glue down this. Make sure I have enough glue in here. Um, where's my towel? I don't want to glue my leg. So. Okay, so this is going to get glued down like right up here. And then I'm going to glue this with my ATG. on my ATG and I'm just going to put it up as far as I possibly can okay and then I have my guy my girl and little Ricky and I don't know if you can see this something. sorry about that let it come into focus a little. Okay. Up, up, up. Okay. So I have my little, my boy and my girl, and then um, I have little Ricky, which I don't know where I'm going to put her yet. I don't know if I should put her on the other page, or I can put her in between. So. Let's just uh, go ahead and glue down the little boy. Again, I'm going to use my ATG. I'm going to put him as far over as I can. It's okay if he sticks out. Um, and then I'm thinking I'm going to put Ricky like right smack in the middle and then let's do Emily and maybe I'll gotta lift her up again in a minute um, just so I can get her on top. Okay, so I have them down. And then I need to put my guys on here. So, and I know the show hasn't aired yet. I mean, it's not on yet. So, um, when the show is over and she picks um, which bachelor she likes, um, I'm going to put a heart next to that one guy so I can always remember which one she picked. And then maybe I'll stick some more flowers down here. Let's see. So let me get my glue. 
just a second here. I have another little palm tree that I was thinking of putting on here that I totally forgot about. So I think that I'm going to put it, it on first. So let's just get this one down really quick before I do the flowers. I'm going to make sure I have enough to hold it down. Okay, and that'll help cover up some of the stuff I don't like on the page. And then now I can add some flowers. I had two flowers. Oh, here's the other one. Okay, so let's do one here. Oh, I think I need another glue stick. Okay. There we go. Okay. One flower. Ouch. That was hot. Okay. And let me get one of these. Pretty bling down here. So pretty. And I want to remind um, anybody watching who lives in the Western Washington, um, I have posted on a website called meetup.com. Um, for my smash book club where we get together and smash together and um, we can meet new friends we can learn new things and so that's what it's all about and um, my next my first meeting is scheduled for August 4th Saturday from 11 to 1 at the Linwood library so um, just go to meetup.com backslash scrap I'm not scrap sorry smash dash club oh my gosh I am like totally screwing this up it's meetup.com backslash smash dash book dash club and you can just go there and um, RSVP if you want to come and um, that's pretty much it for for all that. So, um, I'm thinking I'm just gonna glue this with ATG tape. Um, over here, and it's okay if it hangs off the page. Um, I was also thinking of actually cornering my pages. This is the only one in the whole book that'll be like this, so it'll stand out. And on this side. And this side. Oopsie. So now this is the only one that has the corner pages. Um, I also have some little butterflies by Colorbach. It's from the Victorian Parlor collection and they're epoxy stickers. And they're from Joann's. So I was gonna put that on there. Um, I also had the Bachelorette symbol and this lovey-dovey stamp that I wanted to cut out. Um, there's one more thing I wanted to put on here besides this. Um, what was it? Oh, the ring. I had a little ring and now I lost it. Let's just quickly look for it. There it is. It's a little flat charm and it's a ring I wanted to glue on. Um, I also have some more bling which I don't know 
if I have any uh, room for that yet. But let's see, the ring, I think I will, maybe I'll put it over here next to the guy, or I can put it over here. I don't know. Maybe I'll just put it over here next to the guy. Or I can put it right there next to the love. So let me put some hot glue on this. Hopefully without burning myself. myself before touching the metal and that was not a fun thing so I'm just gonna glue that down on my little love ticket right here and when I'm done I'll show you the whole thing together um, I know I'm kind of off camera um, I don't know if I want any of these dark ones in here or not I don't really kind of go, so I have another blue one. Do I have more pink ones? No. I don't know if I should add some more. Add one over here, maybe. I don't know, I just love these flowers. They're so pretty. All I have for the uh, the little ones, all I have for the blue ones left. Oh come on, glue, come out. Well, okay, so I guess I'm gonna hide another one over here. And get my little gem stickers. So I know it's going to be a kind of a chunky page, but my whole book's chunky, so I guess it doesn't matter, does it? Okay, now I'm just going to randomly, well, I should probably cut this out first because I don't want to cover up any butterflies. So I'm just going to closely cut this out as close as I can, and then I'm just going to um, later on um, at the very end of everything. Um, cover the letters of this with, um, oh, what do you call it? With glossy accents to make it shiny and pretty. So I'm just cutting this out. doing a really quick job but it's gonna it's, um, it's gonna look better when I'm finished with it I, I'm hoping so let's just get rid of that um, and it's a smash book so so I guess I'm just gonna tape it there Sticker somewhere. 
there's some small stickers. I'm just going to put on top the word the. So let's see. Now it's really light, you can't see it, but I'll show you closer up in a minute. Oops, it fell out of my hand. There's the T. And. Oh, you're kidding me. I have no more E's. Great. I have to use a different sticker. I have pink ones, but I didn't really want to use them. This didn't look good, but. I guess I'm going to have to use pink. And it's the only other color that I have. Pink and black. So, there's the T. And these are um, bubble letters and they are so they're small and they they're they look like they have glossy accents on them, so they bubble, but they are perfect for a smash book. So I'm thinking after payday I'm gonna go get all the other colors. And they have them at Hobby Lobby. And there are these bubble abilities. So it says the Bachelor at And, oh, and I was going to say, if you do come to my Smashbook Club, it can be a Smashbook you buy, or it can even be like this one. This is one that I just made, and it's just a really fast little Smashbook, and um, I don't know if I'm going to use this one. I'm thinking of maybe selling it, so if anybody's interested, I have this one available, and... It's really cute. Um, I might even bring it to my club and see if anybody would like to purchase it. But it's got pockets in it. So we will see. That's just another idea. So, okay, so I have the Bachelorette and then I have my little epoxy sticker butterflies. And so let's see. I guess I'm just going to randomly put these like everywhere in all my open spaces because I'm pretty much almost done with this page. So I'm just going to have fluttering butterflies all over. And I, these um, go with the same collection as the flowers so they match perfect. I'm just going to randomly put them all over, so. I love these butterflies. Do 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 do. Keep on going until I use up as many as I possibly can. If I can, I'll use them all.
Let's see. I'm starting to run out of room. So. so maybe I'll just stick some under here since I want to use them all up. Where's that eraser? I gotta erase one more notes that I put on here I forgot to erase. <gasps> okay. Um so I guess I'll just stick the rest of them under here. left anyway. Okay, so they're all there. I'm going to stick this back under my flowers. Okay, I think that's going to be it. So I have all this in here. All I need to do is get my glossy accents and go over the bachelorette, but I'm going to quickly do um, show you my page so you can see it close up. And let me just move the camera so you can see it better. Okay, so. Um, I'm trying to get the lighting so you can see it. Maybe I could fix the lighting before I post it, but so this is this word is hard to see there. So it says the Bachelorette, and then um, we have all this tropical theme. So we have all the the fluttering butterflies. We have the little greeting farm stamps. Um, we have the bachelors, which I'm going to be adding a heart next to the one who wins. Her heart. And then on this side, you just have um, some more of the same designs. Some bling. And a little hidden picture underneath here. Um, little Tim Holtz love tag, um, and some Michael's love birds down there. And these are just black and white photo, um, printouts of palm trees that I did. And I, like I said, I, um, used the pearlescence from Tim Holtz or Ranger on those. And that's about it. So that is my page and hope you guys like it. And if you have any questions, just uh, send me a comment. Okay.